1994 class of Cleburne High School, and will you please bow your heads with me. O oh God, you are our rock, the source of our strength, and in you rest our deliverance. Morning by morning you awaken us, day by day you show us your wondrous love. Graciously you set your feet firmly on the foundation of your goodness, and impart to us wisdom that enlightens our days. Now fill us with your Holy Spirit, and nourish us by your presence. Amen. And now we please rise for the Star Spangled Banner, which will be by Jason Edward Jones.
Americans would say, today is the greatest day I've ever known. We have conquered many obstacles to reach this point in our lives. Many of our accomplishments could not have been achieved without the encouragement of family, friends, as well as ourselves. Over our lifetimes, we have come to realize the importance of family. Without their support, encouragement, and love, we would not be what we are today. Often our parents have sacrificed their time, money, and social lives to support us. I would like to thank my family and all the other families who have been here to praise, prod, and endure their children in the best of times and the worst of times, as Dickens would say. Regardless of the security of families have given, there have been many times when assistance has been needed from other sources. Friends and teachers have usually been the ones we have turned to when we need this aid. Their motivation and positive outlook have improved our self-esteem during times of discouragement and uncertainty. Friends have provided the proverbial shoulder to cry on. Even though we are leaving many of these friends behind, they will still be, still be there when needed, even if only in memory. Those memories will also include our teachers, who have also become our good friends. Without them there to push us to do our best, we would not have achieved our goals. However, at this point in our lives, we must rely upon ourselves. Family and friends are important, but in order for one to achieve goals, we must be independent. If we do not have pride in ourselves, we will not be able to accomplish our dreams. If we believe in ourselves, we can achieve anything we set out to do. With this inherent belief in ourselves that has been in nurtured by family, friends, and teachers, we can conquer anything that crosses our paths. My challenge to you is to make the most of yourself. Return or give back the best you have received from others. Set high standards and strive for the best. You are the future and have the ability to make a positive difference. Even though today is the greatest day that we have known, there are going to be greater days in our future.
Dr. Grunert, Superintendent of Schools, <coughs> board members, by the authority vested in me by the state of Texas, I present to you these 253 candidates for graduation. They have met all requirements as required by the Southern Association of Colleges and Schools and the Cleburne Independent School District. And I now declare these candidates ready for graduation. Tiffany Michelle Johnson. Jason Edward Jones. Seven years, perfect attendance. Jason Lynn Jones. One year, perfect attendance.
Christina Marie Morris. <laughs> Stephanie Catherine Nichols. <laughs> Tyrone James Nunn. Two years perfect attendance. Christopher Scott Nutt, one year perfect attendance. Billy Richard Olson. Christy Sean Opella, three years perfect attendance. Julie Ann Ormsby, three years perfect attendance. Christopher Sean Pack, alumni scholarship, seven years perfect attendance. Michael Andrew Panites. Bobby Jeroy Parker. <laughs> Kalpesh Chantalil Patel II. One year perfect attendance. Melinda Devon Potter. Gregory Joseph Potts. Karen Ann Hugh, First United Methodist Church Scholarship. Walter Cullen Presley. Richard, three years, perfect attendance. Sean Michael Rakos. Philip Allen Ramsey, one year, perfect attendance. Sajal Satish Ranadive. Brinson Delio Reed. Elton Alvin Reeves. Jesse Ross Roberts. Joshua Jeffrey Robbins. Kelly Lynn Robinson. Christina Marie Robker. Sarah Crescencia Rodolfo. William Jones Rodriguez, one year, perfect attendance. Judy Lynette Rogers. Margot Cherie Rogers. Alan Daniel Rose, three years, perfect attendance. Sean Delbert Roy, one year, perfect attendance.
If the seniors will please rise. Now you will please transfer your tassel. the school song led by our senior choir members. heads and pray with me. Guide us, O oh God, as we go out into the world and help us to make a difference in everything we do. Please watch over us all as we return home tonight. Amen. Our 1994 graduates, seniors, you may toss your hats. Good, good call. <laughs> We'd like to welcome our parents and guests down to meet our seniors at the various ends of the field at this time. Once again, congratulations, seniors. Stand by your dad, Branson. Stand by your dad. Stand by your dad. Grandpa. Turn around. Hi, y'all. <laughs> I used to be the shortest one in this group. Yeah. <laughs> Last time we did this. Made it. You made it. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, pretend you like your dad, Bill. 